Okay, today we are doing an unboxing of the BioNO Power Power Pack. This is for like laptops, cameras, anything. You it has a USB connector. It's basically a power pack for any all your auxiliary devices. It's three and three point three five pounds, eight point three inches. Okay, quick disclaimer: I've purchased items from BioNO before. Bioeno.com, power.com. I've purchased their items before for ham radio power devices, um, batteries. For two years in a row, I've gone to the Dayton Ham Fest in uh, Dayton, Ohio, and I bought batteries from them, and I've had a really good experience with them. Um, Bioeno Power, I bought lithium iron phosphate batteries from them before. This is my first purchase at, at Dayton, Ohio. I bought from them batteries and they come with these uh, power pole connectors and the charge connector they have a very high discharge current and you need to be very careful with these if you decide to build one your own so uh, i'm just saying that i've had a good a very very good experience with bioeno power and i have a good relationship with this company so they give you every time you buy a battery you end up with a connector this particular battery i got was for my qrp radios and it is a 36 watt hour 7 amp max continuous this is perfect for small radios okay so i contacted bioeno and i said i love your products and i would take anything you can give me give me a chance to test your products give me a chance to use them i will send them back i will anything so they sent me some products and that's how i uh, attained this particular product okay what this is and the reason i wanted this and i have not used it yet this is an unboxing when you're out in the field and you're doing uh, ham radio, whatever it is you're doing, you need to charge your batteries. And mostly for me, my cameras die. So one of the biggest challenges I have, you know, as a YouTuber, is you get out there in the field and this, this is my primary camera because it's easy, it's lightweight to take videos. And one of the biggest problems I have, especially in my camping videos, is that this thing dies and so I have to start my car I have to plug in the USB um, to uh, whatever this connector is it's like the cell phone connector and I have to charge my camera over and over uh, this is the first battery to die when I do videos especially my camping videos so this fixes the problem that I have and all my accessories to charge all my items and especially my cell phone or possibly my laptop. But let's unbox this thing and take a look at it and see what's in it. So I'm gonna be putting this to the test in coming videos to see what it can do beyond just charging my auxiliary items. Can I use this for my QRP actions? Let's find out, I do not know. Okay. So this is about, you can tell this is about three pounds, right? I it's actually smaller than it looks in the, in the images online. So for some reference, let's take the playing card. You know, we've got maybe two to three playing cards across. Um, this is what I like about it is that it's, it's pretty tough. This is the kind of thing you can just, you know, toss in a bag and it's not going to break or anything. It's got a meter on it. Let's explore that later in the video. It has some kind of handle, which I can't get my fingers in, but this is a fairly new product, but I really, we have an on off switch. You can tell there's a fan back here. Cigarette adapter. Interesting. Oh, I see. You put this in here. outlet that means out and then you put your cigarette device in here and then you get 12 volts I get it so let's give this a charge and see what happens I like how small it is it's tough 
it has it's surrounded by plastic I can tell it's got a fan over here and a plug of sorts here let's let's charge it up before we give it a test okay so I just realized you actually have to <laughs> you have to turn the item on okay this is you know this is discovery and you know don't pretend like you knew this you didn't know it either come on so I'm gonna plug an AC AC item in this I'm going to turn it on now it's fully charged haven't I haven't done anything I just opened the box I'm gonna turn the item on back here now my AC item is running now that's gonna be a little odd because I would never do this you know I would never use this to run this okay what do I see here we have input and we have output so output would be here and this would be to your cigarette lighter type device I actually have a cigarette lighter to cell phone in my car and I also have this came with it so here's where you would use well let's try this what happens if we output yeah, this is how you, this is how you learn playing card it's a lot smaller than I thought so we're going to output to a power pole device now let's suppose we wanted to use this as a QRP we wanted to use this as QRP power right it's not really what this is designed for but let's just say we wanted to do that what happens if we take our power and we now I don't have an antenna I don't have any power in here at all okay let's take our KX2 and see if we can get power check it out so this thing I think I haven't done the math remember I just got this but I think this thing could power a KX2 for a, a period of time so this right here might be enough to put out who knows 1 watt 10 watts 5 watts I don't know I've done, not done the math but that will be very interesting to find out if this could be a, a compact unit as power um, but again remember I take YouTube videos so I could charge this right off of that USB port right there and my radio at the same time or I could use a regular battery you know I have a lot of options but what I like about this and it's why I requested this is that because it is compact it is it has a lot of power and it seems fairly tough yeah this is plastic but it's also not heavy right now I have to question why that light is on because I have it off over here why is that light on I don't know maybe it's a time thing output input actually has an AC power here all right that's the unboxing next thing to do is to test it ow <laughs>